Hi, my name is Emmanuel Alvarez, Director of Operations here at Capture Billing. And today, we are going to talk about no show fees. Here at Capture, we get a lot of questions about should we charge for no shows when a patient doesn't show up? Well, the answer to that is a resounding yes, charge those patients. Let's say you have a patient come in, there's our patient, and well, actually, he doesn't come in, he misses his appointment. Well, what happens to this doctor over here? Well, he's just left twiddling his thumbs, and there is a vacant slot that could have been used for someone that was actually sick. So what we want to do is we want to charge this patient for not showing up as a negative reinforcement of not to do that. So what are practices charging for that? Well, I've seen them anywhere from $10 to $25 uh, for a sick visit, $50 to maybe $75 for a, a wealth check or a physical, and I've seen as high as $125 if they miss a procedure quite a bit. But you're training your patient here not to miss that appointment. Now, how do we inform the patient about this? Well, the best thing to do is when they become a new patient, they should be signing a financial agreement with your practice. In that agreement, you're going to spell out that a missed appointment is $25 or, or whatever you want to charge. It depends on your practice, your specialty, what part of the country you're in, whatever seems to be fair. Spell that out and also spell out how much time they have to give you, how much notice in order to cancel that appointment. Whether it is 48 hours or 24 hours or just that day. Totally up to you. But make sure that they sign that agreement. Because what's going to happen is when you charge them and send them out that bill, they're going to end up calling you and say, hey, what are you doing charging me for this? And you can always refer back to that agreement. Also, I would suggest the first time they miss something, you just use it as an educational call, a talk. Inform them why it's important and possibly even waive that first one. Note it in the count so that if it happens again, you definitely will charge them. But that's what practices are doing, and it is okay, yes, to charge for a no-show fee. Always check with your uh, local regulations, look your state, and with your insurance companies to see how this all works out with them. Remember, a medical practice is a business. Treating it any other way is just nuts.